a short synopsis of the movie Bullet Train. A former professional assassin codenamed Ladybug returns to work with a new positive attitude, where he is assigned by his superior, Maria Beetle, to retrieve a briefcase aboard a bullet train traveling from Tokyo to Kyoto after her normal contact, Carver, had to drop out due to illness. What Ladybug does not know is that there are three other killers on board, Hitman brothers Tangerine and Lemon, and seemingly innocent schoolgirl The Prince. Tangerine and Lemon have been hired by White Death, the head of the world's largest crime syndicate, who took control of the Japanese underworld years ago. The brothers have recovered the kidnapped son of the crime lord and the briefcase with the $10 million ransom and are taking both to Kyoto. The prince calls in another assassin, Yuichi Kimura, after he pushes his young son off a building. With a staff member at the hospital ready to kill the boy, the prince forces Kimura to cooperate with his plan, plan explosives in the briefcase and Kimura's gun to kill the white death. Ladybug steals the briefcase and is forced to kill another assassin, the wolf, who wants revenge for the death of his wife and his entire cartel, poisoned at their wedding. When the brothers discover that the briefcase has disappeared, they find White Death's son dead. The prince makes Tangerine believe that Ladybug is responsible, while Ladybug tries to negotiate with Lemon but is forced to overpower him. Ladybug meets the wolf's real target, the Hornet, the poisoner who massacred his wedding and was hired to kill White Death's son. She stings Ladybug with a syringe of boomslang poison, but he injects her too, then saves himself with her single dose of anti-venom, and she dies instead. After the standoff with Tangerine, Ladybug tries to help him convince White Death's men that his son and the briefcase are safe, and throws Tangerine off the train. Lemon, suspicious of Kimura and the Prince, shoots Kimura, but succumbs to a bottle of water administered by Ladybug and is shot by the Prince. Tangerine climbs back on the train finds his brother's body and confronts the prince, but is fatally shot in a scuffle with Ladybug. Kimura's father, the eldest, boards the train and reveals himself to be a former Yakuza lieutenant whose wife and clan were killed when White Death seized power. He and Ladybug ensure his grandson's safety by having the prince's partner killed, and find that Kimura and Lemon are still alive, and prepare for the ambush that awaits them. The train arrives in Kyoto, and Ladybug is met by White Death and his men. The prince, who turns out to be White Death's disgruntled daughter, tries to get him to fire Kimura's booby trap gun, but he tells her instead that she was never part of his plan. The White Death reveals that he hired all the assassins on the train to take revenge for the murder of his wife. After Tangerine and Lemon massacred his men on a job in Bolivia, his wife was called to bail out their son and was killed by Carver, who tried to murder her husband. And the surgeon who was supposed to save his wife was poisoned by the hornet, which ensured her death by killing the only person who could have saved her. Blaming the brothers, Carver, the Hornet, and his own son, White Death caused all the assassins including the Wolf and Ladybug, who unwittingly replaced Carver on the train to kill each other and his son. Before White Death can kill Ladybug, the bomb in the briefcase is triggered, throwing them both onto the train, which Lemon restarts. As the train spins out of control, the Elder duels White Death while Kimura and Ladybug fight off his henchmen. Lemon throws a hoodlum from the train into the river, causing the train to derail and crash into a nearby town. Ladybug is threatened by White Death with a gun. He tries to shoot Ladybug, but has killed himself when Kimura's gun explodes. Ladybug, Kimura and his father are confronted by the murderous prince, who is run over by Lemon, who is driving a truck carrying tangerines. Maria arrives to save Ladybug, who has since gained a positive outlook on life. 